Well, it has been a wet spring in our high country. We've even had heavy snow in many higher communities. The water we get from the snowpack has a really big influence on what kind of summer we're going to have, including what our wildfire risk may be and the fun we can have on the lakes, reservoirs, and of course the rivers. Your reporter in the mountains, Spencer Wilson, brings us this year's Outlook. The snowpack has allowed the Frisco Marina to put out their pontoon boats pretty early. Normally these come out around Memorial Day, but they have been in the water for weeks at this point. The reservoir is already at 89% full, so the season and staff training can start early. This is phenomenal. Logan Snyder is the boss at the Frisco Marina, and he remembers the years where we were dry. It does make uh, makes things more complicated. Um, we have to keep the docks further out. But not this year. We're still getting massive snowpack even well into May. It's really rare. Typically, you know, you know, to get almost 10% of your snowpack in, in May, we just don't see that. Um, it's less than 1%. That sets up a good year on the water and a good summer for protecting Coloradans in the high country too. It's pretty good indicator too for wildfire risks. The later the peak snowpack, that water hangs around in the watersheds. Um, the plants stay wet, the ground stays wet, and you reduce that wildfire risk. So whether it's a more resistant landscape or the place you like to play, more water is always a good thing, even if it has to come from snow first. It's funny, towards the end of the, uh, the or going into the spring, you're like, oh, I'm tired of snow, I'm tired of snow. But I'm like, wait, we need the snow. We still need the snowpack. We still need the water. Um, I worry about water levels and snowpack pretty regularly. So I'm watching this level like all the time. If the water really does end up spilling over in the Dillon Reservoir, they're expecting to release that water into the Blue River, which would then, of course, make a great water season for anyone who's trying to raft down the Blue River up here as well. In Frisco, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first. All right, Spencer, thank you. We are told as a reminder to Denver water customers, they really appreciate you waiting to turn on your sprinklers after the recent rains. It's a great way to conserve our water store so we still have enough come late summer. Spencer covers what's happening all across our high country for you. Recently, that has included stories from Carbondale to Winter Park and Copper Mountain.